What up guys, my name is Daily Steen from Team Devon and in this video we are going to talk about how to pick an offer to make some profit on Clickbank. So let's dive in. Hey there, Stanley here from Team Devaru and I've got some exciting news for you. The Devaru suite is now live with an all-round affiliate marketing software platform. And to celebrate this, we want to give you a very special offer. You can get 40% off of your first month using the software and to top it all off, we'll throw in an advanced course of choice. So keep your learning going, increase your profit and make sure to go to the link below in the description because there are only limited places. Good luck. All right, so I am inside the dashboard of ClickBank and this are, these are the results of one of our students, Tom, who is really killing it on ClickBank. Look at these results. So the last week he had almost $13,000 profit and the week before that $9,000 profit. So as you can see, he's really improving his campaigns and improving his profit week after week, which is awesome. So if you want to learn exactly how Tom got to these amount of profit, you can ask him anything you want in the Devaru Suite community, ask him about how he finds the offers or how he promotes them, whatever you want to know. Tom is in the Devaru Suite in the community, so feel free to reach out to him right there. In this video, we are going to discuss how to pick an offer and what kind of offers there are available on ClickBank to make your next affiliate marketing campaign into a profitable one. So let's dive in. We're gonna go to the marketplace and in the marketplace of ClickBank, you can find all the different categories and there are quite a lot. So we have arts and entertainment, as seen on TV, betting systems, business and investing, computers and internet, cooking, food and wine, e-business and e-marketing, education, employment and jobs, fiction, games, green products, health and fitness, home and garden, languages, mobile, parenting and families, politics and current events, reference, self-help, software and services, spirituality, new age and alternative beliefs, sports and travel. So there are really a lot of different categories and if you open these categories, you can even find more subcategories, but we're not getting too much into that just for now. So let's go into the arts and entertainment. We're just gonna run through them all. And the arts and entertainment is a lot of, well, arts and entertainment. So things on learning how to draw, learning how to uh, uh, draw animals or draw mandras or whatever, but also, the probably the best offer, the best running offer in the arts and entertainment section of ClickBank is Piano for All, where people learn how to play the piano, or uh, Singorama, where people learn to sing and a lot more. But also, for example, Laserless Tattoo Removal. So for those people who have a tattoo which they don't want anymore, they can basically remove it without a laser uh, treatment. So a lot of different offers here. And as you can see, all of these offers have a gravity. So the gravity is basically a calculation that ClickBank made, makes based on things like how many people are promoting it, how well does it sell. So the gravity is literally a overall number of the performance of the offer. This does not mean that if the gravity is low, that the offer doesn't sell because maybe nobody's promoting it. That is an option. Also, if the gravity is extremely high, that doesn't mean that's going to be success for you because that also means you have high competition. A lot of other affiliates are promoting that offer at the same time. So it's not really about which offer am I going to take, which one has the best gravity. It's more about which offer am I going to create? Where is my feeling? Where's my personal interest? Where do I know to write a campaign for, all right? So for example, if you know nothing about pianos, it might be tough to write the right copy to engage the people that do want to learn piano. However, if you're crazy about piano, you know exactly what's the fun part about it and how to reach and engage those people who want to learn piano, all right? 
So most of all, I would say it's a sort of gut feeling of like, how well do I know this offer? How well can I reach this target audience? Maybe you already have a custom audience on your traffic source to reach exactly those people that you need to reach. That would be perfect, of course. And if not, you just need to find a way on how to reach those people to get and see your offer. So that's the art and entertainment section. Let's go to as seen on TV, which is not any results as of this moment. So we'll continue to the betting systems. So the betting systems is pretty wide as well. Uh, it's mostly on sports bettings, but not all of them are sports bettings. So betting gods, professional sports, tipsers and cappers. Uh, lottery maximizer, new 2020 offers, super affiliates make 10k a day. All right. Draft dashboard. So as you can see, a lot of different types of uh, betting um, offers. So once again, if you're into the betting, then it's um, yeah, it's a really good vertical to uh, to check out, of course, and check out out all these offers. And I would say that the audience of the betting systems who bet on sports and that kind of stuff is a sort of overlap with the audience of casino. Although it's very important to keep in mind that casino and sports are two different types of betting slash gambling, all right? So the gambling is really as, as a part of, um, yeah, entertainment, right? So we're playing a game and it might make some money or it might not, but we're playing the game. And with betting systems, it's really like about, okay, I know this team and I know they're gonna win, so I'm gonna put my money on it because I know for sure that that's gonna make me money as they will win this game or whatever, right? So it's slightly different, but you can see that there's an overlap in the audience. It's both entertainment and gambling sort of together, both in the betting and the casino offers. So quite similar audience, but not exactly the same. Let's move on to business and investing. So here you'll find all kinds of offers on how to make money, wood profits, right? So make money, get a business in woodworking, uh, life coach certification, um, Forex trendy, of course, Forex and crypto, we can't miss that in business and investing. So this is for the people that want to make money. So you're reaching out to the people that want to make money with business and investing, and you show them the opportunities that you have with this vertical. And once again, it's very useful if you have some knowledge about what you're promoting. So for example, if you're promoting a crypto offer, it's very useful if you know how the crypto market works. If you don't know how the crypto market works, then it's probably better for you to promote something else. Even though if it's an offer with an awesome gravity that's selling like crazy, right? If you don't know, if you don't have the knowledge, if you don't know how to reach the audience that you need to reach, it's no use for getting that offer. So really focus on your specialism before moving on to something else. All right, let's continue. We have computer and internet. So this is once again, pretty wide. A uh, keyword researcher, SEO software, become an export expert in laptop motherboard repairs, card recovery professionals. So a lot of different thing, things, both on software and hardware, on how to fix things, how to make things, etc., etc. Then we have cooking food and wine. Here you'll find all kinds of uh, different cooking books, some for weight loss, for example, but others just for fun, just some nice recipes or special diets. So once again, it's very important that you know your offer and you know how to reach your audience because cooking food and wine, it's so broad. The book, the people who, I am, who I'm gonna sell a book on uh, keto meals and diet meals is not gonna be the same audience as the audience that gonna buy a book on how to make vegan meals, how to prep vegan meals. All right, so those are two completely different audiences, even though they're in one vertical. Once again, that's why it's important that you know your offer, you know about your offer and about the people that might be interested in your offer so that you know how to reach them 
and how to engage them in your ad and in your landing page and ultimately buy your product. Let's continue. We have the e-business and e-marketing. So these are all kinds of offers on how to make money online, basically, including some offers on how to make money with affiliate marketing. So you might be able to get your next colleague or competition, however you want to call it. You can drag them into the affiliate marketing if you pick one of those offers. And of course, once again, it's important that you know everything about it, but I assume that you have quite some knowledge about the affiliate marketing or at least somewhat since you're watching these videos. So use that to inform your audience who wants to get into affiliate marketing as well or another type of e-business or e-marketing and use that information to make them feel good about it. Make them feel like, okay, shit, man, I can do this. This doesn't sound too hard. Let's go. I need a course. I need a book, whatever it is that you're giving me. I need it. And then I'm going to make some money with e-business and e-marketing. All right. Next up, we have education. So education is once again, a very, very wide term, right? There's a lot of different education and therefore a lot of different audiences who are looking to get education for different reasons. So spelling B toolbox, uh, CDL test answers, all kinds of things. This is Zen brain learning strategies, how to learn faster and memorize better. So, different core audiences for a lot of these offers. Then we have employment and jobs. So all kinds of offers on uh, jobs and employment earn from your photos. So it's kind of like a make money uh, kind of offers vertical, but not really make money online. It's more focused on make money in general, where we're not really focusing on business and investing. So take out business and investing, take out the e-business and e-marketing and that kind of stuff. And then everything else that makes you money, you'll find it right here. All right. So these are the offers, employment and jobs. Then we go to fiction. There's not a whole lot of fiction, but these fictions are like book based on movies or there are movies. Um, and it's a sort of entertainment, right? So for example, 101 famous quotes from Alice in Wonderland, you need to find that core audience that's really into Alice in Wonderland or at least those type of movies. All right. Then we have games, pretty self-explanatory games, mobile, uh, PC, all kinds of different games. Uh, you'll find them right here. And once again, you need to find the right audience. And I'm going to stop saying that because that goes for every offer. So keep that in mind. Find the right audience is one of the most important things. And also find your own niche. Find what you are passionate about. Because usually we tend to see with our students, if they pick a offer in a vertical that they are passionate about themselves, the results are usually a lot better than if they pick an offer just because it tends to sell well or something like that. All right. And I'm not saying that you should be on a diet to promote a diet offer. Uh, but I should I, I'm saying that you should be passionate about it. So you should learn about okay, what is this offer doing? How can it help? What are the benefits, etc, uh, etc. Et All right. So green products, green products are everything that is basically um, good for the environment, right? So uh, easy power plan, but also uh, battery reconditioning, um, backyard revolution, solar panels, that kind of stuff. Uh, do it yourself sanctuary. So a lot of green energy, that kind of uh, niche. Then we have health and fitness and health and fitness is one of the biggest verticals or categories within Clickbank, I would say. Uh, so health and fitness, of course, has the uh, the keto diets, the diet offers, that kind of stuff, but also a lot of stuff on the fitness side of things where we're not really focused on losing weight. We're more, more focused on, for example, uh, building muscle or uh, sustaining your vitamins and that you take vitamin supplements to feel healthier and better. So once again, it's very wide. Even dental health is in here. You see that? Steel Bite Pro, it's a dental health offer. So 
completely different audiences for the same category, which is why we want to focus on the subcategories and on the offer itself. So read about your offer, check out your offer, check out their offer page, check out their affiliate page, learn as much about it if you, as you can. If there's a VSL, watch it completely so that you have all the information, you know everything about the offer and you're completely prepared to promote it. All right, next up is home and garden. And this is literally everything in and around the house. So this includes do it yourself, burning, uh, building furniture, uh, building your back garden, but also things like training your dog, training your pets, whatever. So everything in and around the house, you will find it here. Then we have languages. So pretty self-explanatory, learn a new language. And this is quite interesting because you can do this in a lot of different ways. And some ways wouldn't make sense and some ways, ways would definitely make sense. For example, if you promote a learn to speak Russian uh, ad in Russia, that's probably not gonna get you a whole lot of sales because people from Russia, most of them already speak Russian, all right? However, if you know how to target the people that do not speak Russian, so for example, by saying, okay, exclude the people with their browser set on Russian. This will only leave the people that do not have Russian as their browser language. Intending, not necessarily meaning, but intending that they do not speak Russian. And for them, since they live in Russia, it might be useful to learn Russian. So therefore, that's how you basically find your core audience. And that is what makes the difference here with languages, all right? Because, what, like I said, promoting an offer to learn Russian in Russia doesn't make sense, all right? So you want to find the people that do not know the language but do want to learn. And then we have mobile. So once again, pretty uh, white, uh, only four offers, but they're pretty different from each other. So this one is phone photography tricks on making the best pictures, but also create apps without coding, guide to buying and selling cell phones. So it's more about the hardware than about the software part. Super fast Android and iPhone and web app for your ultimate retail store. So a lot of different offers there. Then we have parenting and families, and this is all about books and guides and uh, and courses maybe even on how to become a better parent and this is mostly for those newly parents right so a, a mom and a dad that just got a child they have a completely new role now their life has changed for good and now they have the role of being a parent which can be scary sometimes so if you can reach those people who just got parent or want to do better, better at parenting or are scared or about about to get a baby, right? Those are the audience for this type of uh, category, this vertical, as they want to basically get to know everything about parenting to prepare themselves for what is about to come and the new roles that they will get. All right, especially if you're a parent yourself, I think you'll under understand I'm not a parent myself, so I wouldn't necessarily go for an offer like this because I don't know what a parent experience, so I will probably have more struggles trying to reach them than if somebody is a parent and knows exactly what it feels like to be in such a period where you're about to get a baby or just got a baby and you're having a new role and you need to stand up as parent, but how do you do that in the right way? So if you know how to promote that, then look into these offers as well. Next up, we have politics and current events. Not a whole lot of offers here. Trump 2020 products, David Siemens newsletter and podcast and engineering vehicle eBooks. Then let's move on to reference, which is once again a pretty broad term. So governmentauctions.org, uh, government seized auto auctions. So here you can get your cars for a cheaper price since they are at the government. They have been taken from other people and they now sell it. Ebooks, uh, wholesale designer handbag directory, ex-cruise ship officer reveals insider secret of the cruise industry. 
So like I said, it's so broad, luxury wholesale online, monthly subscription, government auctions again, car spray painting videos. So like I said, a very broad term reference. And as you can see, the uh, subcategories, automotive, catalogs and directories, consumer guides, education, etiquette, gay, lesbian, general law and legal issues, the sciences and writing. So very, very broad. Then we have self-help and self-help is another one of those broad terms because you'll find it all here and everything can be self-help for this. For example, this one right here, Trump 2020 cold plated coin. Why is that self-help? We don't know, but where should it otherwise be? We don't know. So it's self-help. So Trump 2020 gold plated coin is one of them. The last way, which is survival. It will teach you on, okay, let's say you have nothing and you need to get your own food and get your own water. How are you going to do that? And this book basically learns you to prepare yourself in case you need to survive. Where are you going to get your food from? Where are you going to get fresh water from, etc., etc. So this is a very good one to promote to so-called preppers, people who prepare for the uh, yeah, the, the world to end or basically something terrible to happen and they are prepared and will survive. Uh, so this is a good book or, or book or ebook. I don't know exactly, but this is a good one to promote to that kind of audience. Uh, but also with self-help, we have offers like his secret obsession, which is a dating slash adult dating kind of um, offer. So that's a completely different part of self-help. Right. So on one side we have survival on the other side, we have dating. So very broad. So check it out. Then we have software and services, pretty self-explanatory, although the software and services are pretty broad, right? So, uh, this one is vehicle history reports. Uh, this one is, I don't know. This one is Forex and this one is also vehicle history report. Uh, best converting windows on installer. So you can see it's really broad, but it's all about software and um, services. So check it out. And if you feel like there's an offer here that you can promote, find your right audience for it and let's go. Spirituality, new age and alternative belief. So this is, these are kind of offers like on fortune telling, uh, hand reading, uh, tarot cards, that kind of stuff. And then we also have the, the, the difference between people who want to know their future and there are offers to know your future. You need to answer some questions, for example, and then you get your, your near future. But there are also people, people who want to learn how to read the future. So that's a huge distinct, right? People who want to know the future, people who want to know how to read the future. So those are different audiences. Make sure that you target exactly your target audience. And then I know you will do good. Then we have sports, <clears throat> which is a combination of sports bettings and also uh, sports as in actually physically being better at a certain sport. For example, vertical jump training. This will teach you how to jump higher and better, uh, which is a great tool for, for example, uh, basketball players. All right. So if you have a custom audience or if you know how to reach those uh, people who play basketball, who like basketball, whatever it is, uh, then it might be very well to promote this offer to those people who love everything about basketball. There's also a lot of golf offers. So the stress free golf swing, etc. And last but not least, we have the travel category. So here you'll find all kinds of travel guides, but also, uh, house carers. So people who house sit your house, but for example, this offer would be a offer that would not make a whole lot of sense to run in a tier three country since I don't know, even if it's allowed, but those people will less likely be to travel and also less likely if they travel to pay somebody to house sit their house. All right. So really look into, okay, where can I best promote this offer? Uh, we have a mountain directory right here, a guide for truckers, RV and motorhome drivers, uh, travel hackers toolkit, a luxury travel on a poor man's budget, 
So a lot of different kind of travel related offers that you'll all find here. So that's gonna be it for this video. If you want to get the same results as one of our students, Tom, which you saw at the beginning of this episode, and do over $12,000 a week, then make sure to pick a vertical that is close to you, where you know a lot about, where you like writing about, where you know that you're convincing enough to reach your audience. And that's another thing, reach your core audience. Focus on what kind of people, who is interested in what I've got to offer today, all right? So really focus on that and stick with a vertical for a while until you really master it and you're the best in the game. And as soon as that happens, that is the moment where you consider taking on another vertical, all right? That's gonna be it for this one. And don't forget, if you want to get in touch with the students, Tom, with the great results, you can do so in the Debru Suite community and you can get 40% off right now. So make sure to follow the link below, get your discount and we'll throw in a free advanced course of choice in as well so that you can learn even more, not only from Tom, but also from our courses and everything, everybody else in the community and you'll be set for all the software you need for your affiliate marketing career. So that's gonna be it for this one. I will catch you next time. Until then, peace out.